What's up everybody, I'm Dave and I'm a Fragrance Bro. Welcome to another episode of my basic series where we answer all the basic questions about fragrance. Today, we're answering and asking the question, how many sprays and where? I'll give some tips on how to spray and where for you, and I'll also show you how I apply my fragrance. Now first, let me just state an obvious. Everyone's physiology and body is different. They may be warmer on their skin, they may be cooler, they may have more oil, they may have less. Your physiology may change how strong a fragrance is. And I say that because there's no one rule to say how many sprays and where for you. Of course, as I've stated in a previous video, one thing that you can always do is check with a friend or a spouse or a partner or whoever to see if you're spraying too much or see if you're spraying too little and see if you smell great as well. Definitely ask them for a compliment. <laughs> there are many different suggestions on how and where to apply fragrances. The first one I think everyone has heard before and what you're supposed to do is spray it in the air and then kind of just walk into it. I would advise against that because if you're spraying a fragrance on your body, one of the things you want is you want the maximum amount of that fragrance to be on your skin. If you spray it in the air, what you're doing is you're essentially allowing the air to dilute the fragrance. So you're not getting all of that fragrance on your skin. The next thing that I universally hear from people is that you're supposed to spray fragrance on pulse points. And while I think this is okay, I don't really think that this really holds merit. First of all, no one sprays their fragrance right here. Okay, there's a pulse point that no one sprays. <laughs> now obviously your neck has pulse points and I think those are fine. Your wrist has pulse points and I think that's fine as well. One of the things I would say about your wrist though is that if you wash your hands a lot throughout the day, what you're gonna find is that you're washing off a lot of that fragrance on your wrist. I've heard other suggestions like spraying on your little uh, arm, I don't know what you call this, the pit of your elbow right here, or the back of your knee, because the fragrance will rise up. And those are okay too, I guess. That's just kind of an odd place to spray fragrance. Then of course there's your neck, the front of your neck, the back of your neck, of course the sides of your neck where the pulse points are. There's your chest. If you have problems with performance on fragrances, you can spray your hair or your shirt. That's kind of a little hack to get a little bit more out of your fragrance. And I would suggest try all of these. Try which ones work best for you. Experiment with sprays and locations and see what you like the best. What I have found is I do four sprays. I do two in the front of the neck, right here, and then two in the back of the neck, right there. I'm set. I almost universally do that with most of my fragrances. There's really only a few exceptions uh, with super weak fragrances where I do more sprays and super powerful fragrances where I do fewer sprays. So in summary, spray anywhere you want. Spray on your face if you want. You can spray your neck, your pulse points, your wrist, the back of your legs, your armpit, your hair, your shirt, whatever works for you. The number of sprays depends on how strong the perfume is. So definitely check with a friend or a loved one to see if you're spraying too much or too little. But just experiment to see what fits right for you. Because if you get great results with the number and placement of your sprays, you're gonna smell it, you're gonna feel great, and you're gonna love wearing that fragrance. Thank you again to Fragrance X for sponsoring this video. Fragrance X is an online reseller with thousands of legitimate fragrances at a reduced cost. I'll have a link down below to them as well as a coupon. I've bought from them so I trust them and I can recommend them to you. So let me know guys. Where do you spray? How many sprays and where? Let me know now in the comments. Of course, if you haven't already, please like and comment down below. I love you for it. I'll see you next time. I'm David the Fragrance Bros. Bye. Thanks everyone for watching. If you like this video, don't forget to check out my other channel, Beast May Reviews, where me and a friend review high quality products for men. You might like it. Go check it out.